Hello students. So let's solve one more problem from ITGEM 2023. And uh, this problem is a very nice one and it is conceptual. And this is from mechanics central force problem. So it is given for central force problem, which one of the following is or are correct. So let's analyze step by step for all statement. So first statement is that Kepler second law is valid. So yes, this statement is correct for all central force because second law is nothing but the aerial speed and that is dA upon dt is equal to j upon 2m. And uh, there is nothing to do with the potential. It is valid for all possible, all central force problem. Okay, so this is correct one. The angular momentum is constant of motion. Yes, angular momentum is always constant in motion when our force is central. And the Kepler's third is Kepler's third law is valid. No, this is not true because Kepler's third law is talking about the time period square is proportional to semi major axis cube. And this is only for only for for potential vr is equal to minus k by r this is only for potential this one. if we will change the potential the time period is going to change okay so this is not correct the motion is confined into plane yes it is correct this is also true for all central force problem so my answer is equal to, is basically 1 2 and 3. This will be my answer. So, yes, it's a, just a theoretical question and central force Kepler's law is only valid for mainly potential which is minus k by r but the Kepler's second law is valid for all possible central force problem. Okay, so this is the argument. Thank you.